All right, House of Pain fans, hope everyone's doing well. Uh, this shouldn't be too long of a video now. It has been brought to my attention. Unfortunately, I don't have access to, like, let's say, either the interview or any kind of article or social media post. So take this information with a grain of salt. That's a grain of salt. That's my disclaimer right now. So if it's proven wrong, then I've already said, hey, I'm not 100% sure. But I've been getting a good amount of people asking me, like, where, where's Curtis at? He's been gone for, you know, a few episodes now. What's going on? Uh, it, like, in universe, if you will, in canon to the story it, it seems that curtis is out and about on this uh, barbecue tour that he postponed because you know after cj got out of the hospital he was making sure you know he'd get back on his feet but you know i guess he could only postpone it for so long and with cj being you know stubborn and whatnot i i had to match he's telling like look oh, oh curtis i'll be okay uh you know just go on your tour you you you, you plan for that for months and whatnot I, i'll get better but we know that Curtis is going to show up again in an upcoming episode, season 10, episode 6, on uh, June 29th, entitled Missing Mustard Seeds. Curtis puts Ella's big day in peril, and Malik takes a class that doesn't go over well with the family. Um, Could this be Ella's birthday? But then again, didn't they have that back in last season? I don't know. But in any case, uh, before moving forward in the video, please take a moment to hit like, hit subscribe, click the bell icon and select all. That way you don't miss out whenever I post new content on the channel and follow me on social media. Links are in the description below. Now, the thing about Curtis being gone, you know, at one point it's like, well, it's not that weird when you think about it, because there have been episodes like, let's say, Calvin or Miranda or, you know, Malik or whoever else will be gone for like several episodes. But uh, in context of, uh, you know, the filming and whatnot, a couple people have mentioned that they do recall Cassie Davis saying something about one of the cast members catching COVID at some point. So we don't know exactly who it is because she said cast member, but one could potentially speculate that LeVan is, let me see if I can find the last, I want to say Davis, but I know it's Cassie Davis, but let me double check here. Yeah, LeVan Davis um, was the one who catched the virus, and that's why he was, quote, MIA for a few episodes. I don't know for sure. Um, so, I mean, that could explain his, like, quote-unquote, three-week absence, but the way Tyler Perry filmed stuff, you know, it's one of those things where, you know, I do recall back when the camp quarantine first opened up, he explained that, you know, if there was... Everybody gets tested prior to coming to the studio. If somebody happens to test positive, they'll come at a later date and then they would film around that person. So, you know, he'll show up at some point. But, you know, that could explain why Curtis, of all people, is gone because, you know, like his wife could have had breast cancer. You know, his nephew is crippled by, you know, a fire uh, situation. So there are a lot of things where it's like, wait, wouldn't Curtis be around for that? But, uh, yeah, like I said, if there's anybody who can find the concrete you know, articles and whatnot. I do recall an article. I don't remember Cassie Davis saying it. I'm not saying the sources that told me this are wrong. I'm just saying that I do remember there was an article back last year that did state somebody caught it, but they didn't say who caught it. And we don't know from what show. But uh, with that being said, again, not too much to talk about in this particular video. Uh, I, let me just say this much. I do appreciate stuff that uh, I want to talk about a video that I do know for a fact and that was the video I did about um, Ella having uh, Bell's palsy because, you know, that video, I had the um, interview clip where she addressed it. And um, I was just blown away by how well that video was received by everybody. I mean, it was amazing to actually talk about that subject in a reasonable way and get the point across that, hey, here's the situation. Yeah, her face might look a little different, but it doesn't matter. That video, ha it jumped from like maybe 3,000 views to over 108,000 in the span of only like a week or two. So just thank you for that. I do appreciate 
uh, you all checking that video out. But aside from that, that's all I have for this particular video. Uh, again, feel free to hit me up on social media if you have the sources for this information to confirm that's 100% true. But like I said, I usually don't like doing videos like this unless I have all the facts. But the reason I'm only doing this video is because a lot of people brought it to my attention. Hey, here's why I think this is why Curtis isn't here. So if you want to donate to the channel, feel free to do so on PayPal or Cash App. And with that being said, I'll talk to you next time.